between all of this, what I've seen is that there are really smart people providing really incredible, thoughtful opportunities for dialogue, but they're not the people that are getting the microphone. No, no. And, and this, is, this is a common issue. This is, this is true in other places as well. Usually, you know, it's easier to go with the rebel rouser or the cavalier, you know, uh, than it is um, to go with the person who's level stayed and mm. actually has some, you know, is going to demand something of you. Um, and, 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 you know, this is, this is a challenge right now is where, where do we find voices that are calling for, you know, authentic opportunities for, for reform? Where do we find the voices that are, are calling for something beyond just a reaction to mm. the inconvenience and even the seriousness of, of this pandemic? That's right. And, you know, the, ch- the challenge is to find those voices. They're out there. Right. And the truth is, is that we have to become ourselves to form ourselves as sort of that, our voice that way, right? Mm-hmm. We have to become, you know, well-formed, logical, loving, super charitable people who can look at the face of injustice, the crisis of a pandemic, and look at all that and say, okay, what are we going to do with this? That's right. And there's complexity there. And I think that's what's really hard for most people in a social media world. You know? Yeah, you can't fit into 144 characters. You can't. You There's can't. A, a nuance required. For sure. And you know, the, the truth is, is that we, we haven't taught people to think that way. Mm-hmm. I mean, it really is. It's, it's, it's not super surprising. We have, we have not taught people how to think this way. Mm. And, um, or how to think. Or how to think, period. period right? Yeah. And it's not a matter of, of thinking like me or thinking like you. It's, it's not a matter of, of even arriving at the same conclusion. It's that there's a basic process that defends the legitimacy of your argument. That's, That's right. all. That's right. You know, I mean, we do this all the time. It's funny. We, we allow this and expect this in terms of marketing, right? Like we get, we get hypersensitive if someone tries to sell something they themselves have not used. Mm-hmm. Or if they give us some line that they've read, but they don't really believe, right? Mm-hmm. We, we know that. We, we want to buy products from people that have some you know, authority or we trust, right? Um, but we don't necessarily do that in terms of religion or philosophy. We just sort of you know, take these sound bites that we think agree <sighs> with our position, and that's a really bad way of forming oneself. Mm. You know, there is an actual process to thinking well. And in a society that doesn't do that um, necessarily all the time, it's hard to find the voices or even listen to the voices that are doing that because it takes time. Yeah.